someone's let's see maybe ask for someone okay so now that i saw a comment about it and i have um full question to talk about it um first of all can we talk about how amazing tiktok room has been they deserve all like all the hype they're killing the game they're killing their job they're doing so well um so everyone round of applause for tiktok room go off you guys are really doing your jobs well moving on from that um i am going to okay i need to swipe out of the, oh, that's the wrong thing <clears throat> okay so basically i wanted to talk about the cynthia situation because she apparently can't deal with it face to face or text me about it like i have tried to multiple times so hi nadina how are you uh, hmm. so let's talk about it hi tiktok room i love you guys um so basically three months ago a very long time ago i called quentin cute once um i'm pretty sure it was the around the same week that um quentin allegedly got caught cheating on cynthia when they weren't really dating so long story short i called quentin cute when they weren't even dating um i am so sorry i feel really bad for that um I actually I actually did feel bad for it um, because I could see how it was disrespectful to someone um, or Cynthia and so I t DM Cynthia saying that I was sorry um, instead of <laughs> hi TikTok room um, instead of responding to me and kind of dealing with it ourselves she just like kept this grudge apparently um, then a few weeks ago i my friend was on the phone with her and i like walked up and like he pointed the camera to me and i told her like face like i told her face to face on facetime um obviously she doesn't she i haven't seen her i don't really know um i told her that i was so sorry and she was like it's fine like she was laughing about it we thought like it's the funniest thing all literally all that i did was call quentin cute um i'm wondering which friends um are telling her this about me and telling her these lies about me saying that i wanted to marry quentin um mm, no thank you but i'm wondering if it's the same friends who talk shit about her to me i'm maybe there's a connection there but who knows um so basically yesterday when all of this drama was happening i was going through my for you page um per usual and comment complimenting people um commenting on tiktoks doing my usual thing and i see cynthia's um video and she was feeling herself she just got her hair done i thought she looked good so i commented you're gorgeous um instead of taking the compliment she responded in a mean way obviously and then goes on live saying that she was uncomfortable like I, like honestly note taken I will not be calling Cynthia pretty or her boyfriend cute I'm I'm so sorry Cynthia for calling you pretty and gorgeous and I'm so sorry for saying that your boyfriend is cute like I'm, I feel really bad about it notes taken I will never call you pretty or your boyfriend cute again I'm just gonna take my positivity and my compliments and throw them elsewhere um i think that for being so for being thought of as so mature um looks wise you sure don't act like it um this could have easily been handled when i dm'd you saying sorry multiple times um so yeah i love how this is the way it has to be handled instead um, I love you guys. Again, Cynthia, so sorry for calling you pretty. Um, won't happen again. Um, and I love you guys so much.